boy the kitty catcher coming at you with another video right now i'm cruising the track it's friday night dude just got paid and they're looking for that kitty cat they're trying to euthanize that kitty them straight them straight alley cats so i'm going down bissonette i'm about to turn left on plainfield it's almost midnight here but as you can see look at all these cars trying to turn to go down the Burger King. All these cars right here. A long line of cars, man. There's a lot of dudes trying to cruise the track here tonight. And like I said, it's Friday. It's payday. And you know, these dudes, man, they're out here looking for that kitty cat. They're trying to catch that kitty too, you know what I'm saying? So, you can see this long line of cars, super long line of cars here. Um, we got some kitties right here. I'm gonna try to be discreet again with my phone and uh, hide it the best I can so that I don't draw myself any type of uh, attention. And some really, some, some kitties right here. Oh, this is one right here, right in front of me. Yep. Uh, so anyway, so I'm right here uh, and I'm trying to be as discreet as I can with this. I'm trying to really be discreet um, with what I'm doing. Um, you know, so, so it doesn't look like I'm filming anything. I see some of the, uh, oh my God, that's Garfield right there. That's Garfield. Ugh. I might have to edit that out, the video. That's gonna hurt dude's, uh, dude's vision. There's some of the, the, the uh, owners of the cats right there, the, the group of uh, black dudes right there. Those are the owners of the kitties. They're the managers, the kitty managers, AKA the pimps. P-I-M-P's, pimping and easy, but someone's gotta do it, right? The dude in the charger up front probably got scared they're gonna bust a cap in him. He peeled out super fast, as y'all can see. So I'm about to turn down on 59 South again and see what else is on the track. Yeah, I got a pretty good view of what the track had right there in the corner tonight. Had some, uh, some of these kitty cats hanging out on that street, but right now I'm about to go down 59, and then I'm gonna turn right, um, right, I'm about to turn right, right here, and see what else is down Center Street. So it's 59 South to Center Street, turning right, and I'm trying to see what, what else I see over here, what kind of, uh, kitties I find like I said it's Friday it's almost midnight but there's still guys out here some of y'all's parents your dad your uncle your math teacher that always gave you a bad grade when you you know when you didn't study for that algebra test <laughs> got some kitties right here lurking yeah right there got some kitties got another big kitty right there that's a Garfield. That's a big one. All this line. Dudes right here trying to pick up some kitties. This dude almost crashed into me. Piece of shit. Yeah, you got a lot of fucking weirdos out here. A lot of drug addicts and dudes that can't drive. To be honest, man, I don't recommend anybody come down here because it is dangerous and you don't want to be down here. I'm just doing this to show you guys the underground scene here in Houston. I'm about to bust another quick lap. But as you can see, I almost got my car hit by some idiot. So you come down here, you take a chance. Dudes might try to crack. Look at this asshole right here. Look at this moron I'm trying to turn here. So you have a lot of piece of shits that, that, that roam this area. A lot of dudes on drugs, a lot of no good piece of shit it's like that guy in the black car right there it doesn't know how to fucking turn anyways 
We got this big old line of cars right here. Um, which is, I mean, look at this line. These dudes are all lined up trying to, trying to, uh, I guess find a, a date for tonight, right? <laughs> but yeah, man, these men out here, you know, it's all types of dudes that you see out here. I see old guys. I see young guys. I see guys that look like they just, you know, uh, it might be their first day in America. You know what I mean? I, I see all kinds of dudes here. Um, I see guys in nice, nice cars sometimes, like, you know, nice foreign cars. It might be a doctor. It might be a lawyer. But like I said, it's a big... It's a, look at this asshole right here that just turned almost hit me too see what i mean so you take your chance coming out here man you know you take your chance getting you know possibly robbed possibly shot at possibly having someone try to jack you you know it's not a fun place that that you really want to be at late at night um you know down here especially like i said right now it's close to midnight Look right there, this guy holding up traffic because he's trying to pick up somebody. So I'm here trying to uh, trying to to turn, and uh, thank God I I just turned. Look at this long line of dudes, man. This is somebody's dad, brother, uncle, nephew, <laughs> cousin. Look at this. Got the wrecker guy out here again, trying to look for wrecked cars, but all he's gonna find is some wrecked, some wrecked kitties. Look at that. Yeah, they got all kinds of cats. They got some snow bunnies. They got the uh, chocolate kitties, plenty of those chocolate kitties. There's a snow, but there's another white kitty right there, AKA snow bunny. Look at this line, man. This line is barely moving. This dude's really trying to get at uh, this one snow bunny that I passed by right now. Um, look at these guys, man. Like, gosh, look at all this line of... Uh, look at this long line of cars, guys. This goes to show you how if, if this kind of stuff was legalized, you can make... The government can make some money and you know a lot of these these kitty cats wouldn't be out here you know with the with their managers getting beat up strung out you know they could probably work like at a like at the bunny ranch in, in vegas right and it'd be all legal and the government would make a lot of cash based off um you know based off what what they're doing um as far as you know regulating this type of stuff but you see this long line of dudes really long line of dudes and they're all trying to get at that one snow bunny that i seen i think that was like basically in her underwear wearing a, a jean jacket so uh, yeah man it's definitely a busy night today i'm sitting here in traffic i mean you can see the line is not moving i'm here uh waiting just waiting here um yeah man look at this i mean we're moving bumper to bumper like we're rush hour traffic on the freeway or something you know after a wreck <laughs> yeah it's that bad man it's like i'm in i'm in traffic after a wreck rush hour traffic cars are barely moving look you see the cars um yeah man so this goes to show you the the lengths that that men go through trying to to find somebody on the track i mean it's just crazy and like i said you see all kinds of dudes here majority of these dudes is probably married to be honest with you you know um you see a lot of guys here that look like you know they're driving even they're driving uh soccer mom vans a lot of trucks or you know a lot of blue collar guys look like they're in work in their work vehicles or you know whatever 
maybe these dudes, you know, they had a long week. You know, maybe they had a long week working construction and now they want to be plumbers. They want to lay the pipe, right? These dudes work construction all week long and they want to turn into plumbers, into plumbers tonight and lay that pipe. So they out here looking, trying to find somebody. So I had to stop recording there for a little bit. I had some kitties trying to bang on my window and I had to tell them to back the fuck up. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so um, this is what it looks like tonight here. I'm about to turn right. I'm on Center Street, about to turn right on Bissonette and uh, probably go out to Ojo's Locals, have a couple of beers, you know what I'm saying? And probably just uh, call it a night, you know what I'm saying? Have a couple beers. Ojo's Locals, by the way, is like uh, a Mexican sports bar where the girls wear lingerie. So it's kind of like a raunchier uh, Hooters for Latinos, like, right? It's for the working the working man. I think they're owned by Twin Peaks, but it's a Latino version. And yeah, man, so a lot of guys out here, like I said, it's almost midnight. A lot of dudes trying to find a date, trying to pick up the kitty cat, driving like shit, driving like crazy. Maybe some of these dudes on one or had a few too many and they out here looking. They out here looking for some 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 action. As you can see, there's some, there's some right there passing by. And, uh, yeah, man, so even with a little light sprinkling, the kitties are still out here looking for them kitty catchers. All right, so like, comment, subscribe. Did you see anything you like in my video? Oh, look at them big, nasty Garfields. Those are pregnant cats. Those are nasty cats right there. Those are nasty, nasty. Oh, I'm going to have to edit that out because i give you all nightmares. And my name is the kitty catcher, not Freddy Krueger. I ain't trying to give y'all some damn nightmares oh by the way this group right here that's like a group of uh church people to try to bring the the kitties like water and candies and cookies and shit like that they're out here like every friday anyways like comment subscribe let me know do you have a red light district in your city and if so what streets or what corner what hood y'all stay safe all right i'm out peace